Tourism is Greece's most important industry, accounting for a fifth of its revenue. So hotel keepers like Platon Lemonopoulos represent the country's best hope for economic recovery. He's been one of the few in the industry to recognize the trends that attract foreign visitors. These guests want extras, such as health spas. The state will even help subsidize their construction, yet many hotel owners fail to take advantage of it. Fortunately, the state and the EU are helping us make these investments in the future, even in times of crisis. Together, they've taken on 45 percent of the investment costs. That's very important in these difficult times for people who want to do business and do something new. And Greece desperately needs to export more. Export-driven firms like Mevaco, a sheet metal producer, are the exception here. Exports account for just 10 percent of Greece's economic output. Mevaco makes sheet metal that's shipped across Europe. CEO Spiridon de Lendas knows his country needs more industry to stimulate economic growth. Exports jumped by 50 percent this year. Still, that's not enough. What we're missing are high-tech products to make us more competitive overall. High-tech is what's important for our country. Most of Greece's exports are low-tech, like this metal construction. Greece isn't exactly a world leader when it comes to cutting-edge technology and won't be for the foreseeable future. Many Greeks are pinning their hopes on farm products, like peaches, to jumpstart their stalled economy. Until recently, agriculture was neglected in Greece. It was viewed as old-fashioned and obsolete. Yet one in ten Greeks still makes a living from farming. Growers like Antonis Karabelas are frustrated by the low prices they get for their crops. He earns just 22 cents for a kilo of peaches. Still, he believes Greece has much untapped potential when it comes to agriculture. The mainland is rich in fertile ground and has sufficient water supplies. We need three things. Better marketing, because we export too little, then state assistance, and most importantly, farmers need to band together so that they have more power. Since the farm cooperatives disbanded, it's the merchants who have made a killing. Without these three things, the future looks bleak for us. Greece has great potential, but must exploit it fast. The Greeks need to get their economy growing again if there's to be any hope of solving the country's financial woes.